So today I thought that I would show you my maps and places I visited. Let's get cracking! As you probably understand by my obsession with maps and postcards, I love to travel. I love to travel to new places. I love traveling to historical places. And I have several goals with my collection. So this is a world scratch map and as you can see I've scratched all the places I've been. One of my goals is to get one postcard from each of the countries or cities I visit. Another goal I have is to travel to all the continents. Let's get cracking, I can show you some of them. So, this is Europe. As you can see, I visited Norway and Sweden, the UK, and mainly England, yeah. Denmark, Poland, Italy, Austria, Hungary, Serbia, Bulgaria, Greece. Oh, and I visited Egypt. As you can see, uh, Africa, even though I would like to go south, the desert, the Sahara Desert. I also visited Turkey. I think that the part of Turkey that I visited is in, is in Asia, but I've also visited China. I've also visited the US and the Dominican Republic in North Africa. America. In South America, I traveled to Peru, Bolivia, Paraguay, and Brazil. And I traveled there with my school class. We traveled for one month and we started in Lima in Peru. We traveled to Cusco and Machu Picchu. And then we traveled to Titicaca Lake, which is on the border between Peru and Bolivia. Then we traveled to La Paz and, and we cycled the death road and we climbed the mountain. And then we went to Santa Cruz in Bolivia. Then we went to Pantanal in Brazil. Brazil. And then we went to Bonito. And then we were supposed to go to Sao Paulo, but in the meantime, we were thrown out of the country. I can tell you that story another Paraguay. So we had to go to Paraguay and just stay there for a couple of weeks. But then we traveled into the country again to Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro. And it was on this trip that I decided to start collecting posts. So that's why I only have one postcard from each of these countries. So the places I need to visit is Antarctica and um, Oceania. Is that how you pronounce it? Well, the part with Australia in it. And lastly, my goal is to see all the seven wonders of the world. So here is my seven wonders of the world. The Pyramids in Giza has a special place and it's not on the list. The Colosseum in Rome, the Great Wall of China is on the list. Machu Picchu is on the list. The Christ statue is on the list. The places I'm missing are the Mayan pyramids in Mexico. Taj Mahal in India, Petra in Jordan. So here are my postcards. This is from my friend's uh, hometown. Grong. This one is Grong in Trendelag. I visited uh, Bø, Bø um, like five times in my lifetime. Denmark, I visited Copenhagen a few times. This one is from Legoland, as you can see, in Denmark, in Billund. Sweden, I have this one from Stockholm, which is pretty cool. And this one from Australian Lindgren's World, uh, in Vimmerby. London, I visited London too. 
So I've been three times, I believe, to Turkey, and I visited Alanya and Marmaris. And oh, I'm missing the one. I'm missing one, uh, which will come in. So, here's Athens. I really love this postcard. I think it's really cute. Uh, I lived in Athens. I studied there last year for about two months. And when we were leaving, me and my friend, we were going to study in Rome afterwards. So, me and my friend, we took a mini interrail. And these are the places we visited. We visited Bulgaria in Sofia. And this is just... So we came from Greece down here and we went with bus up to Sofia. And then we traveled up to Serbia. So this is the postcard from Serbia, from Belgrad. We had one day in each city, uh, and then I'm missing my postcard from Budapest because I've got to buy one. Then, then we went to Venice, and then we ended up in Rome. And I also have a postcard from the Vatican with the Pope Francesco, the Pope. Me and my cousin went to holiday in Bulgaria. And this is the postcard I chose to bring back home. Because there were so freakishly many women sunbathing without their tops on. With a boot. This is my postcard from China. I went to Beijing and this is the Great Wall which actually, which actually is several walls. This is my postcard from Egypt. Me and my boyfriend went on holiday to Hurghada. And then we traveled with bus to Luxor which is the Valley of the Kings for a day and then another day we went up to Cairo and Giza and saw the pyramids which was really nice. I went to New York City City in the middle of December so it was Christmas all around which I personally really loved. It was really busy during that time but Oh, I loved it so much. I love Christmas. And the same trip, the Dominican Republic. And yeah, this is my post. From Peru, I have this postcard from Machu Picchu. <clears throat> from Bolivia, I have this map from uh, La Paz. And then from Brazil, I have this map from uh, Rio de Janeiro and the Christ statue. This is my absolute favorite map. It's a map of ancient Greece or ancient Athens. I studied in Athens for two months and I absolutely loved it. I studied ancient times. I studied classical times, which is around 500 BC. So I really love that I can have a map that shows what historians and archaeologists believe that it would have looked like there. This is the Acropolis with the statue of Athena and Parthenon. And I think this one is Erecteion, but I'm not too sure. This one is the temple of Olympian god Zeus. And around here is where I lived when I lived there. When I went to the Dominican Republic, I bought this map, which is a map of the island Hispaniola, I think it's called. And Haiti is on the left side and Dominican Republic is on the right side. And this is supposed to be a map. 
that shows what the island looked like in 1492 when Christopher Columbus came to the New World because it is believed that this was the first island he entered when he discovered the New World. The last map I have is a map of Europe and sorry about the shine. I have my windows open. So as you can see I've traveled yeah quite a bit in Norway, Denmark and Sweden I've traveled the most this one here is from when I studied in Athens and Rome when I studied in Athens we traveled all over we traveled all over Greece to see places and then we had a week off between our classes in Athens and in Rome so me and my friend decided to take the train and travel like a mini intrail and then we traveled from Athens up to Thessaloniki which I we only slept there for a couple of hours so I don't have a postcard from there up to Sofia and up to Belgrade in Serbia Budapest then we just traveled to Vienna but only to change trains so we went on a night train down to Venice and then we took a train express train down to Rome and with our class in Rome we traveled down to the Suvius to Pompeii and Herculaneum so I totally forgot to show you my globe because it's in another room and it's just this plain globe with lots of dust on it and it spins around and it used to light up but I can't be bothered to change the light bulb so postcards I'm missing are I'm missing one in Turkey I'm missing maps from Cyprus I only have one map from Greece which is the one from Athens but we had this trip to Delphi and then we had a week-long trip to Sparta and Olympia and a couple of other places, which I don't have a postcard. I'm missing a postcard from Budapest and I'm missing postcards from Herculaneum and Pompeii. I'm missing a postcard from Gdansk in Poland and from York in England. And I'm missing several postcards from Norway, Denmark, and Sweden. I'm also missing postcards from the places I traveled in South America, including Paraguay, which I couldn't find a map. Of course, you saw earlier that I only have one postcard from Egypt, but it covers the whole thing. And I only have one postcard from China. Even though we traveled from Beijing and to Xi'an to see the Terracotta Warriors. And I plan on traveling up the western coast of Norway, so we'll fill in that later. And me and my cousin are also planning on traveling from Oslo uh, down to Germany, across Germany to the Netherlands, to Amsterdam and then up again. So I will keep you updated on how that one goes and I will also update my scratching map and hopefully my um, and hopefully my postcard. So that's it for my maps and postcard collections from the places I took. Click like down below if you liked it and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below if you also visited some of these places or if you have any suggestions for the places I should visit next.